how's that, eh? Just rocked up at Bitter Springs and Greg's just put us into a little peach of a spot here. Looks like we're right near the springs. There's water right there and bloody lovely. Let's set up. arrived in Mataranka we have got this epic spot back here which is like the closest to the springs they're about I think about a 10 minute walk from where we are it's like mid-afternoon it's gonna be packed but we don't care we just want to see him and we just want to get wet because it is so hot woke up hopped out of bed feeling great felt refreshed as the shower water hit my face headed to the kitchen and I'm about to get a plate chest up shoulders back. we made it to bitter springs it is so warm in here and because we're a little bit different, we're going to swim upstream and then float down. Because, you know, just do things differently around here. <laughs> time to chill, time to chill. Call a couple real ones, light up the grill. We can just slide, meet me outside. We can kick back with good tunes and good vibes, yeah. Poolside, chilling in the summertime. Cool breeze, blowing and I'm feeling fine. Blue sky, feel the sun saying let it shine. Good vibes, now we living in the better times. So there we are at Bitter Springs. Oh, this is like nothing we've ever experienced. That's how nice. clear the water is. So clear. We and, can't get these two off the bottom. <laughs> and it's middle of the day too. It's not too crowded. No, it's doable. And um, definitely bring a mask and snorkel. Yeah. Because yeah. the water's super clear, but it does hurt your eyes if you open them underwater. So it burns. It's so bring hot. your goggles. <laughs> I bring my snorkel with me everywhere I go. Open your eyes and see clear. Yeah. Poolside, chilling in the summertime. Cool breeze, blowing and I'm feeling fine. Blue sky, feel the sun saying let it shine. Good vibes, now we living in the better times. I can't believe that this is Mother Nature. Like this isn't a pool. This is like it's clearer than a pool. It's, I, I know. My mind is blown, and I'm about to have a kid go under. <laughs> That was really, 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 really nice way to cool down after setting up camp. But um, it was busy and we really want to see this place to ourselves. So everyone's going to love me when I say we're getting up at sunrise and we're doing it again tomorrow. <laughs> right, we've got back to camp. We left the puppy in the caravan. She's not a puppy, she's a big girl. We left the big girl in the caravan and we're going to see what she's been up to. 100% she's on my bed. What do you reckon? My bed. Wow. She's on your bed. I, yeah, I, I think she's deep on Roxy's bed. She's not on Roxy's bed, that means she's on ours. Hi, baby. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Where have you been? Oh, well, she's so nice and cool. So nice and cool. Be sleeping on mummy and daddy's bed. I've been dribbling on daddy's pillow. <laughs> Alright, what's the bedding? I'm gonna go do a touch test, but I reckon it's my bed. Your side, dribble on your pillow. Glorious morning waking up at Bitter Springs. Loving this campsite actually. We only booked for a couple of nights, but I think we're going to extend it. Um, so close to the hot springs for a swim, but today, not sure what we're going to do. Probably hit those hot springs at some point, but we might also head into Mataranka. There's more hot springs down that way, so we'll check those out as well. Heaps to do, but for now, it's a bit of this. So the plan this morning was to get up really early and check out Mataranka Springs because we've heard all the hype about the place. Um, so you've just got to go check it out, right? So we spent the last two days at Bitter Springs. We've got a really nice campsite there and we snuck down to the spring there, which is only like an eight minute walk from our caravan setup. So we've been enjoying that. Um, and despite it being pretty busy, we're still finding, you know, you can find a little pocket there and, and enjoy it. It's, it's a pretty cool spot. We've just rocked up at Mataranka Springs and 
man, there are so many people here. Like we actually probably can't even film the pool because there's like 50 people in it. Um, there's about 348 pool noodles. There's everything you can imagine going on. Honestly, that is not the type of place I would normally go to. Um, we generally try and like find nice, quiet, relaxing places, but it's pretty mad over there. But since we've traveled all of this way, we're gonna get in our jocks and we're gonna jump in and we're gonna go for a swim <laughs> in Matarankas Hot Spring. Feeling game? Yeah! You wanna do this? <laughs> yeah! I don't wanna do this. Let's go. We're, we actually can't get in. Like we're psyching up to do this. It's actually really unnerving. There's a man just in his jocks. And it's not me. <laughs> like this is, let's do this, we're like psyching up. One, two, three. We're still alive. Positives first. The walk in here is actually beautiful. Like the yep. the, the palm forest. The I'll palm, call it. Yeah, the palm forest is beautiful. Yep. The what's that little bit there called? That was called Rainbow Pool. Rainbow Rainbow, Rainbow Spring. Rainbow Spring. When you see that, that's amazing to see the but thermal water it. bubbling. But you can't go in it. On the other side, the water looks beautiful. But actual Mataranka. Mataranka Hot Spring is like is, paved, and it's like. It's like, it looks like a man-made swimming pool. It's like a pool. With like a hundred people in it. And if you're, the, if you're the type of person that doesn't really like crowds, don't go there. Everyone raves about it as like the best place on the planet. Yeah. Totally overrated. Bitter, um, bitter winds. Bitter down. Springs is way better. Catherine Springs in town, way better. Yeah. Um, Berry Springs was better. Berry Springs was even better. Yeah. Uh, bitter Springs is awesome because at Bitter Springs... You can jump in and it's got a nice current and you'll flow like it goes for about 80 meters or so and you can just jump in have your own little patch of water and enjoy it but um that's great that was just this actually felt like gross. i need a shower yeah. after being in there with all those random people and everyone just stares at you weirdly so i don't know yeah. it seemed like everyone was really grumpy in there today um yeah might be know. okay if you get there first thing in the morning but i can't imagine it you know being much quieter you might get it a bit quieter for five ten minutes but that's just I don't know, it doesn't do it for me. It's not our not our scene. But we saw it and it was cool. And yeah. um, we're going to go back to camp, a bit of springs, and we'll go for a dip there. Um, we still might get up super early and try that one in the morning. Um, <laughs> girls want to try and find a turtle. So yeah, that was cool. We checked out Mataranka Hot Springs. We can tick the box. We've done it. Um, just don't need to go back. <laughs> <laughs> doing a little bit of meal prep today we are about to leave the NT sadly and head over to Queensland and I just don't know when we're gonna have the opportunity to find more fresh produce so what I like to do is make a massive batch of like a vegetable pasta which is fully loaded heaps of veggies in it that way if we do run out of our fresh stuff we've still got like lots of good healthy stuff to eat on the road so I'm gonna show you how I do it all right, so my standard ingredients pretty much are sweet potato, eggplant, zucchini, mushrooms, lots and lots of mushrooms, and onion, and then any other veggies that I have left lying around. I chop them all up, throw them in the pan with some lentils and tinned tomatoes, a few herbs, and then that's it. Pretty simple, and it usually makes us about four meals worth for four people. So it's super handy freeze it up and we're good to go. Right, so it's been about 10 minutes. This has been just simmering away, all the veggies chopped up and let's check it out. I wouldn't call myself like a lazy cook, but I'm definitely like a simple cook. So anything that's like quick and easy, I love that kind of stuff. 
So yeah, I'll turn that off now, wait for it to cool, and we've got about four dinners ready to go. Finally done it. We've gotten out of bed like on sunrise to go check out Bitter Springs. The girls are chasing turtles. They heard that there's little turtles in there, so the best time of the day to see that is first thing. And this is probably going to be our last little swim here because we made the decision yesterday that we're going to pack up and head to Queensland. So we're going to enjoy this one and then come back for the big pack up and move on. Um, so we woke up early this morning to come to Bitter Springs again. Hopefully there's less people and our goal is to find a turtle. So apparently there's heaps here but we haven't seen any. Hopefully we can find one. It's so cold this morning so I'll be happy as long as I'm in the water. And blow some bubbles? Yep, blow some bubbles. Okay, this this is magical, like it's quite cold and the steam is coming off the water, you can feel the heat, the sun is just rising. It's like rays just going straight at you. This, so is, cool. this is gonna be a magical experience this morning, I can't wait. magical start to the day. It's just a completely different experience doing Bitter Springs in the morning compared to during the middle of the day. So I would definitely recommend getting up early and experiencing this steam and this serenity. But we're all super hungry now so we're going to head back for coffee, breakfast, pack down and hit the road because we're coming for Queensland now and we can't wait. <laughs> and it's steaming up again. <laughs> <laughs> How good was Bitter Springs? Bitter Springs was beautiful, yeah. Such a cool spot, full oasis, palm trees, river, croc in it. Um, but the springs, the hot springs are like eight minutes down the road and- They're beautiful, oh, You Amazing. just walk, whenever you feel like a refreshing dip, you just walk down there and have a little swim. Such a beautiful place. We've spent the last few days here bloody loving it. Yep. But it's now time to move on. Yeah, we, we're done with the NT now. We're, um, we're heading for Queensland, so we're all packed up and God, I think it's like a one day drive, like a 20. Oh yeah, we've got a long way to Cairns now. Yeah, so. We don't know what's in, in between on the way. No idea, this is all gonna be new to us. So we're hitting the road, we're going east. Uh, thanks NT, it's been amazing. Yep. Catch everyone soon. See you in Queensland. Woke up, hopped out of bed, feeling great. Felt refreshed as the shower water hit my face. Headed to the kitchen and I'm about to get a plate. Chest up, shoulders back, yeah, I'm walking straight. Left all my cares behind me. I'ma keep shining, don't mind me. Keep my head up even when trouble finds me. Time to chill, time to chill. Call a couple real ones, light up the grill. We can just slide, meet me outside. We can kick back with good tunes and good vibes. Yeah. Poolside, chilling in the summertime. Cool breeze, blowing and I'm feeling fine. Blue sky for the sun, saying let it shine. Good vibes, now we living in the Have a little refreshing swim. Oh! Better times. Better times. Better times. Good times. Better 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 times.
Just chill, and at the will, Windows down, they got that real.